Okay, folks, one of the questions that I get asked most often is how do we produce the sounds that we use live on Living on a Prayer? Um, just to talk you through it, we've got a range of splits on offer here. We have uh, in the lower section here, we've got some samples playing the talk box sounds. So we've got that happening down there. We have the, the synth here. Nice, big, thick pad. Pre-chorus has another section, which we'll come to in a minute. And we have a very DX7 like bell overdub that we use for the chorus. So just to talk you through the, the track a little bit, um, at the start of it we, we have the, the pad. So bring the bass notes in there. Before the bass comes in, the drums, and then we come into the next section where we play the sample. Notice there is it's not just playing a continuous sample, I am actually triggering, triggering each note that we've got running there. So we've got and they're samples that come off the original talk box from the original multi track recording. Now, in the pre chorus section, um, we've got something else a little bit spiky, a little bit mid 80s. Um, we updated the sounds a little bit so it cuts through live. Um, it goes something a bit less. Which we think works quite well under the guitars. Then when we come to the chorus, we've got those very bell-like overdubs that come from the DX7, so it goes a little bit like this. And when you add that all together with the full band, we think that adds to you know bring together a very 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 good live performance come and see us the usual suspects and you get to see a lot more of that thank you